So there, you went big with your feet and you stepped outside the line of the ball, caused your hips to open up and then you sliced it. So if you can go shorter, head forward, you'll hit that through here with power. Morning legends, it is 6am on Friday the 31st of May, I am up doing some work, here's the laptop, and here's our baby monitor, um, I'm awake because Scarlett woke up at 4.30 and she took an hour to get back to sleep, so I've been awake since then, and then I was lying in bed thinking about certain things, thinking about um, business related things, and so I just decided to get up, even though I'm quite tired, just trying to get it done. Um, I've just got a flyer to get done to try and send to um, cricket clubs about some work, a workshop I'm looking to um, run while I'm here in the UK. Um, I've got some videos from last night's talk that I want to try and edit and get out. Um, I've got some members videos to edit as well and heaps more happening. So I just was feeling quite motivated while lying in bed so I thought I'd get up and get it done. Um, I'm here at the Airbnb in Bath heading back to London today. I've got to keep my voice down because everyone's still asleep. So just getting on with the grind. Hey vlog, I'm here with my wife and the in-laws and little Scarlett is trying to fall asleep here on me. We're just at University of Bath. I'm gonna have a look around there. Apparently amazing um, sports facilities. Apparently they've invested a lot of money making their sports center incredible. So we're gonna have a coffee and look around that. Before getting on the road, um, had a busy morning getting content out this morning, catching up with some admin. Um, then we're on, I'm on the road driving an hour or so to Salisbury, gonna get dropped off by Mrs S and Scarlett. They're gonna head off down to Southampton and I'm gonna get the train up to London for the weekend. Bath Uni, incredibly impressive facility. Love this sort of honours board. Now we walk outside and here we are for the outdoor facilities. Amazing running track. Some girls getting trained over there. Awesome, probably Olympic track. Looks like hockey and soccer over on the far field and then same again, hockey and soccer. This is an absolutely brilliant facility. Vlog. I've made it to back to London on the train from uh, Salisbury to Waterloo. I've now walked 10 minutes from Waterloo Station and I've booked a net. Um, I've got one lesson with a guy from London, so he suggested we use this facility. It's called Archbishop's Park. Um, so, yeah, it's a pretty cool park. They've got five side soccer here, they've got tennis courts back there, and apparently these nets are really good. So looking forward to having a session with this guy now. Here's the nets, they are pretty sweet. Here in central London, I've just set the camera up, got Paul over here ready to have an hour session. Loving this facility. Got the camera ready to go. 
Shot. Good. Didn't feel balanced there? Hey? Did you feel balanced? Yeah, and I reckon you're just here, yeah. and then you sort of push and you have to take that extra sec. So if you can get your head and weight over, you should be more balanced. Head forward. Nice. Oh, there we go. Lovely shot. Um, one thing that was noticeable, and I don't know if it was because you had someone videoing, but that video you sent me, you were so rushed in between balls. Yeah. Like, I don't know if that's a normal yeah, session, no, I think that was of... but you were like, hit. It was like you were like on steroids or something like. Um, so don't, just take fractionally longer and get yourself set up, because if you're rushing, you're not going to get in the right red starting position, and then you're not going to react and play the ball well. So just give yourself fractionally longer. Good. So there, you went big with your feet, and you stepped outside the line of the ball, caused your hips to open up, and then you sliced it. So if you can go shorter. Head forward, you'll hit that through here with power. A little bit better, feet. Yes, how'd that feel? All about head, but if you're sort of used to doing that and leading with your foot, yeah. your weight will stay back. Yeah. So you've got to sort of try and get into a nice, um, powerful position where like you're leading to the ball with your head and your foot will follow. That'll, if you can keep your head out in front of your foot, your power will come. Not bad. Yes, that's class, mate. How'd that feel? So what, what exactly, so try and understand what you did. What did you do? Yep. Yep. And I, I, it's something. Yeah. Let the ball then come closer to you. You can then accelerate into the ball. Yeah. If you're moving here too early, you end up getting and it becomes yeah. very hard to stop or slow down. Yeah. And then you end up slowing the swing down, and you got no power. So if you can hold, I'm doing a lot because I think I've been going. And then you wait. Yeah, you're so early. Yeah in landing and then you're slowing your swing down, no power. Yeah. So bat speed you can sort of generate by holding still for longer, landing and then accelerating. Oh. Wee, well bowled. That nipped away. Not bad. Good. Shot. Feel good? Nice. Solid, solid. Good feet, fast feet, good. Yep. So when it, I don't know, have you seen much of my content? Like how long have you? Yeah. 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 So something I talk a bit about is the size of your step on leg stump. Yeah. So when the ball's coming there, down middle and leg. Yeah. If you go big, you have to then play around your pad. You have to, like, from your top of your back lift, back lift to the ball, your leg's in the way. So by taking a shorter step, what some people do is they step outside it, like you did before, and you end up opening up, and you can't hit through there. So if you go short, smell that weed, shit. If you, um, if you go shorter, you can then hit through mid-on, but then you can start to open up square. So when it's straight, it's hard, but really try all it is. Show me how wide your stance is. One of the things I often struggle with is, is like leg glance yep. there for that reason. So because like your, your, your feet are a bit wider than shoulder width, okay. you don't even really have to step. All you have to do is turn that slightly Sorry. and then get your head and weight out in front. Yeah, and, then. and then you can access out in front of your pad. Okay. Take the ball early, take the ball sort of out here yeah. in front, and then you can hit early wherever you want. As opposed to waiting for it to get too close. Oh yeah, if it gets yeah. too close, it hit your leg. Yeah. So you've got to take it reasonably early before okay. it hits your pad. Yeah. And then come through with your swing for me. Yep, just try not to, so start again. So try not to, go, go start your downswing. Try not to come through this way too early. Okay, yeah. You want to come through straighter. Yeah. And then at the last point you can so, turn. Okay. So it's sort of like 85% of your swing is straight and then it's a flick. Okay. It's not there and then across. Probably yeah. yeah, so try and look to hit straight and then you can flick at the last second. Okay. Nice. 
Yeah, good. How'd that feel? Good. Shot. Power. Hey vlog, just finished the session. Um, really pleased and uh, impressed by these facilities here in Central London, not far from Waterloo Station, so really easy to get to. Here's my man Paul. How, how'd your hit go, mate? Yeah, really good, man. Really good. Get my head at the ball, wait for it, short stride, and just come out the middle. Yeah, absolutely. He's got a lot of ability and highly skilled. He was just getting in some of the wrong positions, which meant he had to sort of push his hands at the ball and couldn't get any power just by waiting a bit longer and then getting his slightly shorter step, head to the ball, he was smacking him. So yeah, plenty of runs to come, I reckon. Hopefully this evening. You're beauty. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I really appreciate you taking your time out of your busy life to watch this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you got some value, please subscribe below. Hit subscribe to our channel. We, we try and publish some really interesting and valuable content for you guys. So subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out our next two videos here below. Make sure you subscribe and also turn on post notifications and join the CM community by purchasing some merchandise. Link is in the description below. Thanks, legends. Now go out and get it done.